Let me go to another point, yung staffing summary, and this has been my advocacy uh, for quite a long time. I know first year pa lang ng uh, DMW, tinitignan ko po yung uh, unfilled positions, medyo malaki pa rin kasi 60.9% uh, of your manpower, this is more than half uh, of your manpower, remains unfilled for 2023. We wanted to find out the challenges uh, you are encountering and how do you plan to address this uh, staffing uh, summary. Ito, pakita ko po. No? Um, it, it's still the same, I think, as last year. Eh. And uh, we wanted to find out kung uh, our recruitment procedures uh, are working. Uh, Ma'am, sir, please. May I, Mr. Chair? Yusek Hans? Yes. Uh -oh. yes, go ahead. Yusek Tonet. Yusek Tonet. Thank you, Senator Joel. Uh, we we concur with your, with your observation, sir, na medyo uh, nabagal yung proseso. We became a victim of our own <laughs> advocacy announcements. Uh, would you believe that when we announced in March the recruitment vacancies, we received 16,000 applications? And so we want to do justice to all the applicants and comply with civil service established recruitment rules. But the good news, sir, is that it's moving. We are targeting to complete uh, barring any disapproval from COMELEC of the ban on appointments, which will begin uh, by Thursday this week. Opo. We hope to complete the processes, deliberations by end of November.